Hi guys, my name is Lindo. I am going to tour a little bit of Rosebank Mall and the zone. They are separated into two, but normally we just refer to it as Rosebank, okay? Such a, a big place and chances are if you're going to be a vet student, you will be doing your shopping here uh, because this is where the buses on weekends, they come to drop students here hourly. They circulate hourly from respective races. They bring you here after an hour, they come back again. You can catch the bus, go back to your respective area. You can spend as much time as you want as long as you won't miss the last bus <laughs> which normally leaves rosebank at five then at rosebank there are so many stores that are student friendly like you know when you want to buy your groceries or when you want to buy food and if you want to just get chilling with your friends this is just a, a, a good place i've seen a couple of famous people around this area so chances are if you are that kind of a person who likes meeting you know the celebrities and people of that nature you might see them here the brands that you like such as adidas supega who like you'll get to see them you'll get to see all of them here some of the stores they're not yet occupied and i'm taking this video at the time when it's about to be christmas so you'll see some t christmas decorations around the area but it's not always like this these christmas decorations they only put them up when it's towards christmas when there's like when december hits and then you start seeing these things yes it is already december and i am still at rest uh that is because um we finished our examinations late this year normally by the 22nd or the 27th of november i'll be done and going home but then this time around finished my last exam on the 1st of december so i'm still here that's why you get to see all these christmas decorations it's such a huge mall um the parking lot outside is uh kind of it's really big to accommodate enough people there's also the spot whereby i don't think you have to this one that we are seeing on the clip you don't have to pay to use it but i do think that there is this you know kind of the security tight one but well i've never seen any incidents happening i've never heard of any stories of people getting robbed so it is such a cool place it is such a a place where you can just come chill with your friends the area that i'm about to show you right now is an area whereby it's full of you know those perfect background pictures that you <laughs> perfect scenes for the background when you're taking pictures i hope i make sense so i remember in, in 2019 i and my friends we came here to take pictures it was such a, 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 a lovely spot to take pictures because of the greenery, there's beautiful flowers, beautiful stairs. Well, maybe right now it doesn't appear as beautiful because my quality camera is so poor. The quality of my camera is, is so poor. Please help me donate a good camera. <laughs> there's this main made waterfall that is cute. Um, it's really tall there's this tall building i think there are offices there but uh, the shopping it just remains on the second floor you can see that the area is really 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 big it's really big especially on days like this when people are doing shopping grocery shopping for christmas the kids they also want christmas and we live in the in an era where there's this coronavirus so and people are really getting sick at this time of the year people are really getting sick because of this covid so people they come here to also stock up medication and you know there's this idea that we might go on lockdown again but then other than that i came to the crazy plastic so that i can buy this particular suit crazy plastic is filled with all the things that you can imagine especially things that are made with plastics i'm shooting uh, this pecan not because i'm a fan but they are so expensive for my liking but i do like them i wanted to buy this particular suits but i couldn't get them so i just opted for what i could find i also had to show you some of the stores that are available the things like this cam you'll also they see there's mr price home there's also mr price the usual mr price that there's also jet there is legit there is a uh, mr price spot you'll see them not really in this videos but uh, you, if you come to Rosebank, you will get to see all those stores. That's why I said it has all those student-friendly stores and student-friendly brands. I went to PNA specifically to buy some crochet hooks because I want to teach my kids how to crochet. 
so i do have enough yarn so i don't want yarn i want specifically the crochet hooks you'll get to see them i'll take two of them pna is such an art store chances are you'll buy something before you leave here so i wanted two of them but i also wanted to buy a, a skipping rope for exercising i went to checkers got some watermelon got some yogi seed got some two spices and my little mini shopping that i did not intend to do just happened just like that now i'm done i just have to go back to rest go catch the bus the last bus which is at five and go back to rest when i went outside i noticed that it rained whilst i was still inside the mall but i think you saw from the previous clips that you know the weather looked kind of cloudy and it showed that it might rain anytime yes so it did rain luckily enough it's waterproof and everything else we did not get to be wet so right now i just have to take the bus be careful that the hooding cars they don't hit me <laughs> or else i'll be in so much trouble now i just have to take the bus the correct bus they are written that this one is going to rosebank and this particular rest rosebank to this particular rest stuff like that the one that i have to take it's going to junction that is my rest for this year junction and when i got to rest yes it was raining and bye